is the most wonderful time of the year, and we are celebrating the holidays here at Amp It Up. And tonight, to kick off the holiday season, we have our friends from Red Path joining us again. And you guys are doing original Christmas songs, right? Yes, we have three originals. I'm so excited. I love Christmas music, so holiday music. So we're going to get started tonight. Go ahead. The snow is falling outside my window The fire's burning and everyone's here That's the heart of Christmas this year Joy to the world The Lord has come for everyone Our violinist, our fiddle player, I'd say, is Hannah Kalish and she was just a blessing to find. Um, she is such a sweet woman. She's so talented and just a joy to work with. We have six or seven shows and they are all around the city. So we have one in Montemita, we have one in Duluth, Rochester, New London. So they're all over the place and we're really looking forward to reaching people that we haven't even met before. Um, people kind of on the verge wondering, you know, hey, you know, should I go to a Christmas show? It's going to be um, faith-based but also secular music. So there's something for everyone really. Santa is that you? Well, it's all about Santa, right? So talks about Santa on the rooftop, just all the feelings of Christmas night and the excitement of what Santa's going to bring. Am I on your naughty list or 
Santa is that you under my Christmas tree. Our guitar player is Rich Larson and he plays acoustic guitar and he sings too. And we were just so blessed to find him because he's all around talented, very creative, and just like one of those people that you just love working with. You know, you like you go to work and you have coworkers that you enjoy being around. He's one of those guys where he's just like fun loving, easy, and so talented. So we feel so fortunate to be able to have him backing us up. Did you catch Santa one year? Because I never did. Oh, many years I've caught Santa. Really? Yep. Hoping to this year again. Yay! I love holiday music. We will be back with more Red Path and Amp It Up after the break. visual presentation device. Do not attempt to adjust the picture. And put that remote down. We are controlling transmission. We control the microphone. We control the camera. We can change the focus to a soft blur. Or we can zoom in on the moon for no apparent reason. We can control the backlight. We can control the key light. And the fill light and the electromagnetic visor. Join us, human, and learn how to control all these things with your own puny brain. You are about to participate in a great adventure. You are about to unravel the mysteries of making your own film. When you journey to townsquare.tv for Filmmaking 101. Oh, I'm so bored. My life is boring. Boring? Magdalena, uh, uh, I have a cure for your boredom. You do? Yes, get connected with Town Square Television. They will teach you how to use video cameras, learn how to edit, and produce your own program. But I don't know how to do that. I'm a superstar. Had I not got connected with Town Square Television, I would have never worked with such fine actors as Hugh Laurie, Kenneth Branagh, or Sting. Really? Lots of puppets. Uh, people make programs at Town Square Television. They do? Yes. You should go online to townsquare.tv. There you'll find everything you need to know about their classes. Well, I suppose I could check it out. It looks like you need an ace. You rang? We use everything as inspiration for songwriting. I mean, mainly experiences that we've gone through, um, different relationships that we've had that have either failed or worked out. And for the holidays, I mean, 
there's so much inspiration. It's everywhere, just the snow, especially in Minnesota, um, the joy on everyone's face. Everyone just gets that, especially in Minnesota, very jolly during the holiday season. And then obviously the birth of Christ is the main inspiration for most of our music on our Heart of Christmas CD. Welcome back to Amp It Up. We are here listening to more holiday music with Red Path. So I'm anxious to hear more. You guys have more original ones too, right? Yes. This okay. next one is not original, but... But a, a classic it's nonetheless. A classic with a favorite. Yeah. Good. Take it away. song Go Tell It on the Mountain. Um, we've been singing it since we were little and this time on the CD I get to sing lead for it so it's actually dear to my heart. Um, the arrangement was really fun too. We put our own style into this song. It's definitely got some country feel to it. While shepherds kept their watching or silent flocks by night Behold throughout the heavens there shone If I were a color, I'd definitely be pink. And if you ever went in my home, you would know I have a pink office. My little girl's room is pink, of course. And I love pink. I just love it. It's just happy and light and uplifting. And I put it in my office because it puts me in a good mood every time I walk down there and a pink lamp, everything kind of matches. And I just feel like, ah, oh, this is my, my zone. I would probably be yellow because I love yellow. I don't know why it makes me happy too. <laughs> and it makes me feel warm like the sun and it's fresh. It's in my bedroom. I love yellow. This time of year was a lot of fun to write because I wrote it um, as the, the seasons were changing into the fall and I live in Stillwater so everybody comes downtown Stillwater shopping and it's fun to just watch people's excitement and kids and grandparents and families um, come and look through the windows at things and um, so that's kind of what sparked that first verse and then it just went from there so it just talks about all the things that only happen at Christmas that you just you have to stop and and appreciate and it makes you smile just I love the weather change I love when it just gets a little bit chilly and when the snow falls, people put up their lights. It's just things that we look forward to every year. It's that time of year when they light a 
Dozens of toys in the store's windows Everyone shopping despite the snow The spirit of joy and love are in the air The child is come to save the world He loves us all I love like, this sounds weird, but like I love Martha Stewart crafts Just crafting, taking care of the home having a little girl um, at the end of January, beginning of February, sometime in there. So I'm so excited. She's very wild, crazy right now, kicking a lot. And it's the first baby, so everything, I mean, and she'll be an aunt. It's just crazy mm -hmm. to think about. Everything is a new experience. Like every time she's kicking or moving, I'm just like, oh my gosh, it's just, it still surprises me. We will be back with more Red Path and Amp It Up after the break. Do you know what this is? It's a MacGuffin, a plot device in the film we're making. Do you want to be a filmmaker but you haven't found the right place to learn how to do it? Join us for our semester-long hands-on course in directing, shooting, and editing and get started making your own film. Check out our Filmmaking 101 class at townsquare.tv. We all have stories inside us. I know I do. These stories come from our experiences and imagination. I imagine things all the time. A screenplay is a story told in a particular way for a particular purpose. What's that? For making a film. Writing a screenplay is not quite the same thing as writing a novel. It's important to know the differences. Why? A reader experiences a novel. A viewer experiences a screenplay when it is made into a film. I like movies. The screenwriter must always keep in mind how each scene will be experienced by the audience. What will each action and each line of dialogue make the viewer feel? I see. 
If you've never written a screenplay but want to, you probably have many questions. Yeah, I do. How do I format Just my screenplay? the camera angles I'd like to see? Can I add films to my actors? What is my guffin? It's easy to get hung up on the little things. I'll say. So let's work through your screenplay together. Register for Screenwriting 101 at townsquare.tv. I grew up singing from a young age, singing with my sisters. I'm the oldest of the three girls. And our mom taught us how to sing, so that was just something. We had music always in the house. She played the piano, and we'd get to pick songs out of books. And, and then it just kind of kept going from there, just singing in choirs and community events, and then going to college for music. And it's just something that's always been in my life since day one. I've always had a love for it. Well, I don't remember the first time, I guess, I sang. I was told I was singing animal crackers in my soup when I was little. But um, after that, I did remember, and we would sing on the fireplace. And I think I kind of just followed along in her footsteps. She kind of led the group, led the crew in singing. And so I just remember that. I just remember being led by my sister. And, and then going off after high school to college and um, study music as well. Welcome back to Amp It Up. We're going to get to know Red Pack a little bit better because some of you will remember that they have been here in the past. So, Lauren, thank you guys so much for being here, all of you. We're missing you, one, we and are. we've got two new additions. Yes. Correct? To we the band? Do. It's two good to be back. and almost three. Yes, and a future <laughs> singer. Congratulations. So, thank by you. By the way, could I'm you so introduce excited. the band? For yes, us? well, you should know this is Tori. I'm Lauren. We are the original founders of Red Path. We are sisters. We have Rich Larson on the acoustic guitar and Hannah Kalish on the fiddle. Violin behind me here. And you have one more original song for us? Or we is do. this a, okay? Yes. What's it called? Take Me to the Water. And this one is on our American Made CD. So. Okay, so this isn't a holiday nope. song. This nope. is just an original, yeah. Awesome. Inspirational song. Take Me to the Water is a song Lauren wrote a while back, um, and it talks about just, you know, struggles in life. Everyone goes through struggles, and specifically um, about an addiction, correct? It was about um, someone struggling with uh, alcohol, um, alcoholism. So um, I love this song, though, because, you know, whether you, you struggle with with alcohol or whatever, you can relate to it. Everyone goes through something and, and the Lord washes us clean, you know, from all of our struggles and He, we can let it go and just, you know, let Him um, replace that struggle with joy. And so the cool thing about that song is it can relate to anyone and yeah, Lauren wrote it, so she should probably actually talk about it. <laughs> I like this, I like listening. I'm like, yep, that's right, that's right, keep going. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you again, Red Path, for being here. Thank you to the rookies that joined you tonight on Amp It Up. We love you having, love having you here. So, thank you so much. And whenever you're ready. Watching his life go by, but he can't see in front of him. A few years have come and gone, but he can't seem to move from the place he's stuck in. He cries, bring me to my knees and take me to the water, wash me. I like hanging out with my family. I love my husband, my little dog, <laughs> my little Hi, chihuahua, Pico de Gallo. Blind man, blind man, sitting down, kissing his life goodbye. He would drink his liquor till he drowns, and now he's gotta try to swallow his pride. Bring me to my knees and take me to the Wash me clean, take me far away, and take me even further from this place. Old man, old man, looking back in time. 
happy he put that bottle down, swallowed his pride. Cause love saved his life. Bring me to my knees and take me to the water. Wash me clean, take me far We have music available online at www.redpathonline.com and it'd be wonderful to see everyone out at a show this Christmas season. Thank you so much, Red Path, for being here again. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. You guys can come back anytime. That wraps it up for this edition of Amp It Up. From all of us here to all of you at home, happy holidays. I'm Colleen Fuentes. This is Amp It Up and we will see you next time.